If you've ever wondered how we lift these massive sections of our new bridge tower into place, that's what we're going to take a peek at today. We're going to take a look up here at the top at the strand jacks that actually do the heavy lifting of the segments. And we're also going to take a look down low at the roller assemblies that move things into position. Well, most of the public, when they're looking at this construction site, they see the large tower crane that we have erected out there and think that it's doing the heavy lifting, but it does not have the capacity to lift the heavy loads that we need for this job. A strand jacked operates very much like pulling a rope. Use one part of your hand to pull the rope, use your other hand to lock it off so that you can pull the rope again. What happens here is that the strand comes up, it's locked off, and then the piston comes down and pulls it through again. The strand is actually taken up in these reels so that it doesn't unspool while the operation is taking place. The roller assemblies you see here are real workhorses for this particular operation. They're carrying over 617 tons of weight and they're doing it very efficiently as these segments are tipped into position before they can be lifted up into place on the bridge. Thanks for watching this episode of Bay Bridge 360 and be sure to check back with us as we post the progress building this new bridge.